Welcome back to Command Conquer, Tiberian Dawn. Welcome to Mission 14 for GDI. It's not over yet. But we're closing in on Nord. A little bit of progress into Hungary there. And here we go, still in Serbia, or Yugoslavia. I owe you an apology, Commander. I got it wrong. Kane ducked out of the lab when he lost our satellite feed. He's slippery, but his days are numbered. His troops are squeezing through this ravine right here, apparently in an attempt to regroup with Prime HQ. If you're quick enough, you can pick off the entire Nod column as they roll through, while our field strategists plot the location of that main base. It's fish in a barrel time, Commander. Here we go. We have these limited forces to blow up some Nord reinforcements, which we will do. First, you guys are going to do... You're going to go on a little bit of a detour. Because there's some artillery I would like to kill before we move forward. Will you please catch up. Overall not that difficult. The possibly most confusing part here is that well, those things, those guys didn't even react. Is that there's a, a stealth tank on the map? I think the idea behind the stealth tank is that if you defeat all not force on the map, you win, even if no reinforcements have arrived yet. So what you could do is kill all the artillery pieces, and then you just win without the actual not forces that are moving through the area ever showing up. So they didn't want that, so they put that one stealth tank there in the northeastern corner. So you, you can't just do that. And if you reach the, the stealth tank, then the reinforcements are going to pop up anyway, so they kind of avoid that. You can explore that in some missions, famously the Beerless Talk mission, where you can... There we go, goodbye. Where you can simply not reach the village at all, and as a result, you're going to have... Let's sort you guys a little bit here. As a result, you're going to not have to face the not light tanks, which, in my opinion, is something you should just generally avoid. So, there we go. Overall, not that tricky. But again, another mission where, if you know what to do, it helps a lot. More so than on some other maps. It helps on every map, but it's, some maps are still not that difficult otherwise. Yeah, what we're going to do here, we're going to place ourselves in the in the, the center of the map, if you could actually cross this bridge here. Of, co of course there's a bridge. That's just, that's to be expected. There we go. You wait here. Vehicles, you kind of get in the way here. Artillery, you stay back a little bit. There we go, there they are. Artillery first. Oh, those are the artillery pieces from the canyon. Like the, the two on the other side, I think. There they are. Light tanks, not that big of a deal. Stealth tanks, pretty brittle, so also not that much of a problem, I think. That's slightly more stealth tanks than I expected. But never mind. There we go. More light tanks. Boom. This may have been it already for the for the main wave here, I think. I suppose so. If not, they will come after us sooner or later. And there's no real time limit here. It's not like the Nord forces are going to leave at one point. And then you just lose. They essentially just move through the area and if you, I think if you don't engage them, they just they just stay there. Okay, let's just move north. And let's find that stealth tank. I think it's either one or two. It doesn't really matter that much. We have enough force left to take it out. There we go. And it, it can't kill the mammoth. 
Okay, someone else is left here. It's alright, we'll, we'll find you. Is there more artillery here? No, there isn't. So it's possible that one stealth thing actually slipped through, or that there's one somewhere over here. That's fine. Just check our corners. Looks clear. Yeah, so these are pieces that used to be in here, they they moved as well. I think those were the ones that engaged us from the north in the beginning. So maybe just go down here just in case. So we don't have to move back later, but it doesn't look like it. And I think if there had been anything there, then we would have... Then that tank would have engaged us here or there. And there we go. Let's wait for everyone to catch up here. I mean, the mammoth tank alone can kill this guy here. Nope, still not it. Oh, there we go. Yet another one of you. There we go. Yep, not that much for challenge. The mission feels kind of odd because it's uh, it's a lot easier than even some of the earliest missions, in my opinion. Even if you fail it, you can just retry it because it's just like five minutes long, so it's not that big for challenge. Uh, more difficult on the remastered hard mode, of course, but even then it's not that challenging. Got more than a thousand points, however. That's said, thanks for watching, I shall see you next time in the final mission, or one of the final missions. Take care and goodbye.